Hello there, fellow uh, heroes. I just wanted to let you know that uh, y'all are just just dazzling me. The capes uh, are looking good. I I see a few of you e- e- even decided to just go full out with a uniform. Now, um, I really, um, God, after the, the last workshop, the one thing I do, and this is just personal, I'm not going to do something if it doesn't make a difference. I'm just not going to do it. It's an insult to people and, uh, uh, and for myself. So I'm not. So I asked people, I said, did you get anything out of that? Just a little bit, something, give me some love, something. And a few, uh, there were people who said they got some value. So I said, okay, if, if one person got some value, maybe somebody else got some value, but y'all too stingy to let a brother know. Shame on you. Shame on you. Your mama didn't raise you right. <laughs> now, uh, awesome. but I, I did, but because I, I actually do love y'all. That's right. I'm going to say it. I love y'all. It's cr- I, I don't know why I do. And if some of y'all are married, don't tell your husbands I ain't trying to hit on you. I love you. So the course we're going to have, and, uh, and I say a course because we couldn't do this all in one town hall. It's just too big. It's too explosive, too transforming. It, it's going to rock Sykes. It's going to rock Lowe's. It's going to rock GE. Okay, I, I, my cousin is Donald Trump, seven removed from a, another planet. Now, um, so this is the love course, love, access to power. Next slide. Love, access to power. We live in a professional world, and we do professional things. How can love be appropriate for business? I, I get back, y'all rushing my slides. Okay, all right, all right. Don't don't let me have to go way. get George. Don't let me have to get George Jefferson. Now and, and hold the slide at the end. Don't move it. I I I give you a clue. What's love got to do with it? Love is at the very core of why you are a hero to the card holder. Yes, the love you receive in your heart of hearts from making a difference and being a service. Now, I want you to think about that for a moment. You're a customer service, customer care professional. Does anybody really think that that's an accident? That you sitting in your seat with that fancy rhinestone cape, that it's an accident that you're someone who is service and cares for people. Now, you might be a book writer, author, student, this Whatever may just be, mo- but let's go to the next slide, please. There. Now, one of my favorite people, a hero, he, he, he has his own cape there. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. said, everybody can be great because everybody can serve. This is who you are, someone who is great. Now, it is not about your job. It really isn't. It's where your heart lies. And this job, any job you have, anything you do, is simply a manifestation of what is in your heart of hearts. Now, in this course, we're going to start a little inquiry that we'll have. I'm going to, now, I'm promising you this, I'll pro- and I'm going, to, I'm going to tell you I'm better than Donald Trump. My hair looks better. I'm pretty. I just don't have that wife in that airplane. But this will have your VOC scores jump off the roof. Your QCALs, you go, I, I, I'm going to tell you, Sykes, Lowe's, GE, Synchrony, Bank, all them people, they're going to be going, what happened with the mighty Lowe's teams? Because they just can't, huh, what's going on? We thought we had the, the, had the big bad, oh, no. Now, I promise you, it will be as hard as you choose to make it. That's your choice. Now, you could come kicking, screaming, all of that. You can do that. Or you, or you can be like my buddy Alex. He ain't here tonight who, who just said, I'm going to just go with the program. And he got that little tops award. Now, I also promise that we will all get to the finish line together. Now, that means that even those who aren't here tonight, they're in the course. They're in, that's right. Don't let on. By the way, our little secret, 
the coaches, the team leads, the account man, they're in the course, too. They just don't know it. Now, don't let them know that because then they'll get all out of hand and start picking with it. Now, and I'm in the course, too, because, you know, you know I don't know what I'm doing right. <laughs> you know, I'm in the course. I don't have the answers. Not that I don't. You know, I'm in the game just like you. Next slide, please. And Ronnie B. Alex is here. <laughs> oh, I didn't say, I, uh, my man, Alex, uh, hey, party in the boys. I mean, but that's later. Now, love is the key. You, 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 you are whole, complete, filled with joy and love, but there are barriers. There are barriers that keep you from experiencing your wholeness ongoingly. There are little barriers. Next slide, please. Now, uh, I'm going to briefly share something, and it, it's about people. It, it's something that happened, but it really gets to the essence of uh, no matter where you are, you're you. So uh, you may have visions of, a, well, hey, look, this is just a stepping stone, but you're you here always. Saturday morning. Beautiful Saturday morning in Houston, Tech. I mean, this is one of those mornings I get up. Now, I'm a flower plant kind of guy. I, I like flowers, plants, and stuff. And I'm in my little yard, and I'm putting a little flower. And it's me and, and the divine and the universe. I, have you ever had that where the sun is just so, it's just you, and it's just like me in the moment and, 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 and the spirit and all of that and nature. And, and you could just be there. And, and I'm there. I'm, I'm there. I'm like, wow. And I, out the corner of my eye, this, this boy, this, this kid, uh, I see him walking down the street. Then I see him walking back. And I just get that feeling. Now, he's going to mess with me. Now, I, I'm enjoying myself. It's me and the divine and universe. Well, this kid getting ready to mess with me. So I'm like, but I'm still with the divine, the spirit, the universe. It's good. Oh, I feel it. So he come, the kid comes back. And uh, now... I'm a little skeptical because I'm kind of a headed, very attractive, you know, black man. And this happened to be a little little white teen-looking kid. And I'm like, ah, oh, no, no. You know, hey, you know, I grew up in the hood. Well, what you want, boy? So, and, kid, don't you realize that I'm with the universe at this moment, with the divine, the spirit, and all of that. And you interrupted me. The kid says, well, mister, uh, I'm feeling well, I'm feeling well, and can I uh, have some medicine? So I'm like, oh, well, you know, I am gracious. Oh, son, I, I can't give you know, medicine. You're a minor, you know, all that stuff. But, you know, parents. Oh, well, my mother's around the corner. I said, oh, okay, well, you know, make it around the corner. Well, sir, can we talk? And when he said that, something hit me. He said, uh, can we talk? And I knew at that moment that it was like, we just met a rhyming. You may with the divine and the spirit. But something led this kid here to you. You know, like some of your customers come to just you. And he said, sir, uh, I talk to you for a minute. So I'm like, okay, because, you know, something might be going on. And he said, said uh, sir, my mother's getting married today. And uh, I, I really don't like who she's marrying. And I'm like, oh, okay, oh, okay, kid, hey, 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 you know, I'm Uncle Ronnie. <laughs> All of a sudden, you, you know, you go through that, blah, 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 blah. Well, she's, mar she's marrying another woman. I'm like, she's marrying another woman. Well, I happen to live around the corner from a church that has people of uh, uh, who are gay, lesbian, community, top one in Houston, beautiful people. And I'm like, oh, wow. And it really hit me that, what am I going to say to this kid? And I said, and I just told the truth. I said, oh, you're scared. You're scared. And why would you be scared? You're scared because you're going to be the kid in school who says, oh, you got the mother who married to another woman. And you're scared for your sister. You mentioned something about that, that she's going to go through that too. And his face lit up because I was telling the truth. And I said, but don't forget this. She's scared. Your mother in her heart of hearts is doing what she, what is right for her. And she knows that you're going to be the kids who everybody's going to point to. I said, do you get that she needs you? And he looked up and he looked at me. And 
you know, and, uh, you know, and he just brightened up and he said, my mother may need me. I said, yeah, she may need you. So he left and, you know, and I got back to being one with the universe and the divine. Stop being. Stop being who you are. A card holder calls up all set, all distraught, this and that. You got that call for a reason. Well, the signal you've got to move on. These glasses mean something. Boop. Next slide. Yellow, now we're going to touch on yellow sunglasses. The filter we listen from creates the occurring world, which was really great. The ladies earlier were what they were discussing is how they took power in creating the world. Being a hero to the cardholder requires a special listening, a listening that seeks to generate empathy and grace. This is a basic tenet of love. Yepers, that is true. We are looking. We, as on, on the line, we're looking for the love. More importantly, what is missing so love can be present. Next slide. Thank you. A barrier that keeps us from connecting with our cardholders or people because wherever you are, life, that's where you're going to be. In general, it's the filter we listen through, yellow sunglasses. Now, let me tell you a little something about yellow sunglasses. Now, you see those glasses, they're yellow. When you first put them on and go outside, what color is it? Now we got to move along. Come on, y'all got to tell me something. I'm not going to say another word till I get some response. Come on, yellow. come on, come on. Oh, all right, thank you, yellow. Now, <laughs> after you wear them for a while, you know, like all day, the world doesn't look yellow. What is it? It is yellow. Now, uh, as an aside, write down three filters or conversations you have about cardholders or people in general that impact your listening of them during conversations. What are the barriers, the filters that, and one of them might be, when they say you people, a filter comes up, and from then on, the conversation, you know, goes through that. Next slide, please. The current world, the filter you listen through, will by default create the current world of the conversation between you and another. If the current world is strange or difficult, everyone will experience a level of strangeness or difficulty. Does anybody resemble this? Next slide. Absolutely. Uh, looks like me. <laughs> <laughs> Next slide. <laughs> looks like a good day. Okay. If the occurring world is one of love and service, everyone will experience love and service in some form. So you've got to get kissy, kissy smooches with them, but the love will be there. Now, here's your love work until the next, next session. All right, list three categories. List these categories. Work, yourself, family, relationships, and romance. Okay. You want to list those, and they're going to send this out so you have a copy. But you want to write those categories down. Next slide. Now, under each category, this is what I want you to write. Where is the presence of love missing or not where you would like it to be? Okay, where is the presence under each category where is the love missing? Or it's just, this isn't where it should be. Now the second part is, and what conversation are you willing to let go? Or maybe you need to create a new conversation so that love will be present. You people. Yeah, I'm one of them you people. I'm on the mighty lows team. Yeah. Every day until the next town hall, you want to add to your list. So you want to keep going. You want to rotate them. You've got a lot of people in your life. Customers come up, work issues. Where's the love? Not where it should be. Now, each day, choose someone on your list where the presence of love has been missing. Communicate with them and have a conversation that restores the presence of love. Now, a lot of y'all are going to go, I was great with the list, doing all of that, but you want me to actually talk to somebody? I, you know what? Some of y'all might actually call a friend you ain't spoken to in 20 years and say, you know what? I, I, you know, we loved each other, and, 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 and I, just, I want it back. 
Being a hero feels good because in your heart of hearts, you know who you are and what you gave, and you are proud of yourself. You wear your cape well. Thank you, wow, thank Ronnie you, B. Thank, thank you, you. Ronnie Yay. B. If anybody, please Ronnie speak B now. Ronnie B for president. Please speak now if yeah. you're not. <laughs> if you're in the room but not on the bridge, please speak now so you can get uh, paid. Everyone, please, please fill out the closed loop feedback. Um, I just can't say how, enough of how proud I am of this whole VOC team. They did such an awesome, fantastic, super, super, superstar good job tonight. Everybody give them a big hand. <laughs> yeah, great job, guys. <laughs> Excellent work. Fantastic. <laughs> Yay. Awesome. So, and and you, give each one of yourselves, <laughs> I want you all to have a uh, applause for you for coming, <laughs> taking your time. We, uh, we do this for you. We try to make it as happy and pleasant as can be. And tonight, I think we, we, we passed that. We did fantastic. So if everybody can please do the closed-loop feedback. Eva, Joni, do you have anything to say? 